The top 10 most pricey sneakers ever made. You're definitely in the right place if you want to increase your knowledge and pick up some intriguing facts along the way. Our goal at Exclusive News is to ensure that everyone is aware of all the information that relates to life's biggest and best things. Every single thing that has made up the culture and society of each high-flying millionaire or billionaire over the past 20 years, including the things, locations, and people. Something that has increased in significance and appealed to rank among the top collector fields in the world today. Are those sneakers? Yes, that is accurate. The common sportster that we all adore for its comfort and fashion value can actually be worth millions of dollars. And today we are here to present 10 of the most costly pairs in history. Welcome if you're a new visitor. Without further ado, let's dive right into the list of the 10 priciest sneakers ever made. A fusion of prices paid at private events and official price tags to make sure we can provide you with the widest possible selection. The Nike Air Max at position 10 sold for $37,500. The iconic, futuristic Nike Air Max, worn by Michael J. Fox's Marty McFly in the 1980s classic Back to the Future Part Ada, are at the top of our list. They are an exact replica of the crazy shoes featured in the movie and feature an electro-luminescent sole, a 30,000-hour rechargeable battery, and iconic self-tying laces. Only 1,500 pairs of the airbags were distributed in the initial batch. The first pair of the batch was auctioned off in support of Michael J. Fox's Parkinson's Disease Foundation, and British rapper Tinny Tempa won them for a hefty $37,500. Brian Chen's Nike Air Force One, model number 9. For $50,000, Thames Kutcher and jewelry was sold. A pair of sneakers created especially for American Big Boy of Outcast is ranked number 9 on our list. If you aren't familiar with Big Boy as an artist, all you need to know is that the big guy doesn't hold back when it comes to bling and fashion. And this was unquestionably the case when he received a pair of unique Nike Air Force Ones designed by Pre and Clint's Kutcher and jewelry which not only included the recognizable Mike Squish, but also a good dose of gold and diamonds weighing 11 carats. The worth of the Air Force once increased to a stunning $50,000 when precious metals and diamonds were added. The eighth item sold for $50,000 and was a Nike Air Yeezy 1 Grammy prototype. The first mention of one of the most recent and enormously popular superstar shoe collaborations in recent years appears in number 8. Kanye West is also known as Yeezy. The rapper donned this same pair of sneakers to the 28 Grammy Awards, where they also happened to be utilized to announce the now iconic collaboration with Nike. In recent years, different styles of Air Yeezys have become extremely popular and some of the most expensive shoes on the planet. Furthermore, these Grammy prototypes are now available for $50,000, even though they were originally offered for $75,000. $60,000 was paid for number 7, an autographed Nike Air Jordan 1. It's safe to say that the name of the illustrious basketball hero that they bear makes hundreds of distinct Nike Air Jordans, worth thousands of dollars. However, when you factor in the fact that the rock star who unites cultures has really signed the item, you may watch as the value soars. This particular pair just so happened to have the great man's own handwriting on them, raising its price from a few hundred dollars to an unbelievable $60,000. Think about the uniqueness and value that your name and identity would command. Everybody wants to be like Mike No. 6. The price of Drake's Air Jordan 12 was $77,000. Sometimes the shoe's backstory, along with its excellence, increases its value. And with a couple at number 6 on our list, this is unquestionably the case. One of the most stylish artists working in hip-hop today is the Canadian rapper Drake. As part of his contract with the Air Jordan Company, he received a special pair of Air Jordan 12s which he later gave to a woman during a Toronto Raptors game out of the goodness of his heart. The woman, who was undoubtedly more business-savvy than sentimental, sold her Drake sneakers and netted an astounding $77,000. That is what we refer to as obtaining value for your money. Strangely, Drake gave away a pair of Air Jordan, tens of the same game that only sold for $15,000 total. Take a moment to view our special film about everything Nike before we move on to the top 5 most expensive sneakers. After all, without Nike, there would undoubtedly not be this wonderful list to appreciate either. By clicking in the upper right corner, you may view 15 facts about Nike. 5th, Michael Jordan's game while sick. For $104,765, an Air Jordan 12 was sold. And a similar tale to Drake's with a comparable set of shoes. This pair of Air Jordan 12s which Michael Jordan himself wore during his memorable flu game, starts off the top five. 
In spite of having a severe case of the flu, Michael Jordan managed to produce 38 points and win his beloved Chicago Bulls, the 1997 championship game against the Utah Jazz. A significant triumph. Jordan was clearly sick during the game and a young ball boy tried to cheer him up by feeding him some applesauce. The NBA player also gave him his match sneakers as a token of appreciation. Nearly 20 years have passed since that terrible day. The ball boy, who is now an adult, fetched an astounding $104,765 for those unique shoes. That's actually quite good for a tiny bowl of applesauce. The gold medal winning converse of Michael Jordan, which came in at number 4, sold for $190,373, shattering the previous record for the highest price ever paid for a pair of sporting goods at auction, which we just mentioned at number 5. In June 2017, a pair was sold for $190,373. Michael Jordan wore them once more, this time in the match against Spain in the Olympic gold medal playoffs in 1984 in Los Angeles. This pair of Jordan shoes, unlike the others on the list, are genuine Converse. It was Jordan's final game as an amateur and the last time he wore Converse in an official setting. After scoring 20 points in the USA's 96-65 victory, Jordan turned professional and inked the now-famous contract with Nike. Jordan signed the Converse sneakers which also had his ortho insoles and were taken from the LA Forum by a ball boy. The third Nike Air Max with power laces cost $200,000 to buy. On this list, we've already seen a pair of Nike airbags from Back to the Future. But the cost of three exceptional options in 2016 easily outperformed that figure of $37,500. Only 89 pairs were made, and they were sold to raise money for Michael J. Fox Foundation. The majority of pairs had a $10 entry fee, but the three pairs who went to auction netted incredible sums. In Hong Kong, the first couple earned $104,267. The second pair was put up for sale in London and sold for $56,000, but the winning pair outbid them all and sold for $200,000 in the New York auction. There is a rumor that someone in Japan paid $2.2 million for a pair, but we have been unable to locate any proof to support the claim. The second pair of shoes, known as the Fire Monkey to honor the Chinese New Year, went for $4 million. The Sneakers Rio 2016 partnership between New York lifestyle brand Bishan and designer Dan Gamma of Moked Bespoke Sneakers. They were made expressly to be auctioned off to raise money for Souls, a charity that works to fight poverty by collecting and distributing shoes and clothing. The shoes include a solid gold souvenir tag, with the logos of the two firms stamped on it hanging from the laces, which contain eaglets set in diamonds. They are a custom take on a silhouette designed by Wade. The sneaker's upper features a blue, white, and gold daisy pattern that is embellished with sapphire and diamond set 18 karat white gold chips. For $17 million, the first place Air Yeezy 2 Red October was sold. The Air Yeezy 2 Red October are by far and away the preciest sneakers in the world. According to the legend, Kanye West was promoting his most recent album. He sought out the ideal pair of sneakers. That is the simple to read October that was created in collaboration with Nike. The shoes nearly instantly sold out after being made available. Nevertheless, one iconic pair made make it onto eBay after being sold out, and in record-breaking style, the bidding war grew to a final price of $17 million. Due to eBay's nature, there's no way to verify that the person who placed the astronomical offer for the sneakers paid the whole sum. However, that pair of Air Yeezy 2 Red October will be remembered as the most expensive shoes in history. There you have it then. The top 10 most costly sneakers ever made. Are you a shoe enthusiast and collector yourself? If yes, which pair have you ever owned that was the most valuable? Please tell us in the comments. As a thank you for watching the entire film, here is one more interesting fact. Michael Jordan's first contract with Nike was for five years, paying $500,000 per year, plus stock options that brought the initial sum to $7 million and included the promise of a signature shoe. The Air Jordan Michael Jordan's signature shoe sold for $70 million in the first two months it was on the market. We appreciate you taking the time to visit with us. To ensure that you never miss a video, be sure to subscribe.